One definitely stands out, and I know, again, I was with you. I've travelled a lot around the world with you, I have to admit. So that, and we've done a, done a few rides together. It makes the conversation easier. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. Um, it was when we were in New Zealand, and um, which what were we filming? Which fi- It was a Hadian. It was a Hadian film, yeah. That's right. Um, we were coming back from Dunedin, and we, were, we had like, an, I think, two hours of light left, and we were thinking of – trying to go to Wanaka and trying to find some different roads over there, epic locations. And we were going along the, this road and there was big mountains all around us and, and the water was just there. And we could see across the water there was this path right at the bottom of this mountain. Like it was crazy. It was cut into the mountain. Yeah. So the mountain didn't go flat at the bottom. It just yep. dropped away into the water. So we were, we were driving for like kilometres and we were just going – is that over there? How do you that that's that's a path. That's not a road. And we just kept talking about talking about it. We must have been driving 20k and we were still watching this. And there were times where I know I swear I saw cyclists over there. And we were like that's that's a bike path. We need to get there. What is that? We didn't know what it was. So then we kept jumping on the Google Maps, having a look, trying to work out where did where would it start? And then the light was going down and we were like what do we do? Do we go over to Wanaka or should we just try to find this? And we just made the decision. Let's go. I think and after watching it for 20 minutes, yeah. we're just like, we have to get there. Yeah. Like oh, that's a- there was a moment, or yeah, like we have to get there. There was a moment where we saw this bridge mm. and and it was just in this unique place. And it, it wasn't like a, a car bridge. It was a walking bridge up high. Um, and as soon as we saw that, it was like, yeah, we, we need to do it. Yeah. So what happened? How did we find it again? It was Google Maps. It's sort of like, um, I don't know if you could see the trail, but there was sort of like only one road that went anywhere near that side of the river. Yeah. And we just pin dropped it and there was like a winery or something there. And then... It was like, yeah, there was a tiny path that went down the bottom of this winery and yeah, there was no signage anywhere. It just was just there. And we just navigated ourselves from a way around via, this, uh, via the phone. And it was cold. I remember it was freezing. But anyway, long story short, we found the start of the run and we were like blown away. There was this path that was probably two, three meters wide. Gravel just followed the river. Amazing, massive mountain just there right to our right. Water was like right at the bottom and it just went around and around, went over these, these tiny, this path I remember it was cut out on these rocks and which hung out suspended like a like a bridge cut into the side of these rocks. It felt a bit dangerous, but I remember going around. And then one cool bit that I remember though is it it then tracked through the mountain. Luckily, we're on the Hadings. I don't think the Series One GTR would have made it, but we we went this way, and we had to go all the way up this mountain. These beautiful paths that were just like tracked. It was in, chicaning up a mountain yep. like a rally course, yep. like. So we went higher and higher and higher and then we went down, 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 <laughs> down and then we found that bridge. Yeah. And we had a full battery too, I remember. We, and we weren't quite full when we started because it was the end of the day. Yeah. But I remember both of us like watching the battery. I was low and I'm like, i got to turn around when it gets to this percent. Yeah. But it just kept getting better. Yeah, it did. Um, so it worked out. I remember it was – I'm pretty sure it went for about 50 kilometres – yeah, so one I, I actually know what it is. Okay. It's called the Lake Dunstan Trail. It's about an hour out of Queenstown. Yeah. Um, chuck in Lake, Lake Dunstan Trail and you'll find the trailhead. Yeah. I think, yeah, it's 48 kilometers each way. Yeah. And it is a, amazing. It's a cycling path, um, but it's not very busy. You can go like a good speed. And yeah. the fact that it's not straight, it's got a lot of turns and little yeah. obstacles like these chicanes. It goes up and down and inland yeah. and up the gorges, across bridges. Totally. That's my number one. Yeah. That's the best ride I've ever done in my yeah, life. Yeah, yeah. And it's and it ticks every box. Yeah. And not to mention the scenery is like next level, out of this world. Yeah. It was so good. I ran out of battery five kilometers or something from the, the yeah. trailhead, mm. had the camera bags, carrying the board, you were yeah, telling I me. I was telling you. Yeah. yeah. And I remember I just made it back. Like maybe I ran out 100 meters from, from the car. Um, so yeah, we've, ever since we did that, we've definitely been talking about that run many times. Um, if we could do some kind of event there or a group ride or a tour, um, 
Yeah, it's just epic.